impact. And one of the biggest highlights was around uh, how much communication um, is contributing to the overall patient perceived success. And so obviously we know the relationship um, and connection with your patient equates to how, how um, the outcome um, is going to be perceived by the patient. So uh, it's obviously an ongoing process. It's not just during the initial evaluation, um, but with the survey that we did, we found that only 30% of patients uh, were receiving regular communication between appointments. And so, you know, it's kind of the old school way of you go to a visit, you see the patient, patient goes away, you never talk to them again until the next time that they come in. Um, And so that disconnect is not helping with home exercise and adherence. um, And so they're, they're, may do nothing in between visits and they only think that you are supposed to help them get better, right? And we know that's not that that's not true and that patients must be um, more compliant with their home exercise program to get the best outcome. Um, and so, you know, the ones that the therapists that are sending their patients away with the paper format home exercise program versus a digital one are getting significantly less um, adherence as well as decreasing the uh, the overall um, patient perceived outcome. Uh, so uh, digitally optimized home exercise programs are definitely the way to go. 